tea. Now I absolutely love tea. And today I wanna to talk to you about the fat burning effects of tea. First thing in the morning, I always start my day with two cups of tea. I add a little bit of sweetener, and honestly, it's one of the things that motivates me to get out of bed. Now, beyond the taste and the love that I have for my tea with my stevia, tea actually has many health and fat-burning benefits. Now, if you check the label of your bottle of leaner, so if you don't know what leaner is, it's one of the best fat burners on the planet, and it's exclusive to Fit Club, but in the leaner, you're gonna see that the top fat burner there is going to be the green tea extract. So in today's video, I'm going to cover the fat benefits of tea. So the first thing you have to understand that it's gonna boost your basal metabolic rate. Now, what is your basal metabolic rate? Well, it's the number of calories that you burn at rest. So when you normally just rest, your body needs calories to have you breathe, have you talk, to keep your eyes open, to walk from your desk to the kitchen, to walk from your car to work. That's your basal metabolic rate. Now, the nice thing about tea is that by having it in your system, it's actually going to slightly raise the temperature on how many calories you're required to just do your daily living. Number two is that tea can actually help you decrease your appetite, which then is gonna help you with your fasting protocol. Now, if you don't know what fasting is or you wanna find which protocol is best suited for you, look up Fit Club Winnipeg, look up which fast works best for me. I just released it a couple weeks ago and you'll be able to find out which fast is gonna work best for you to burn the most amount of fat. Now, we know that the longer that you fast, the more chance you have of using fat as fuel, whether it be for exercise or your basal metabolic rate. So by consuming tea, it's going to help you decrease your appetite, which is gonna help you to stay in your fast longer, which is then going to help you burn more fat as fuel. And last but not least, we gotta understand that fat actually helps to digest and break down fat. ECGC, which is the catechins, help to go inside the fat, and it goes to break up the fat that's stored, and it makes it more metabolically active so that it can be utilized as fuel. So once again, the ECGC, or the, the main component of T, goes into the actual fat cell, which makes it more pliable, so it makes it more broken up and easier to break down, and so that when you start to breathe, or you start to move around, or even better, when you start to exercise, especially in a fasted state, your body's going to be able to use more of that stored body fat as fuel. Now here's the thing, to see the big time fat burning benefits of ECGC from tea, you would have to use it as a supplement because one cup of regular green tea contains about 50 to 100 milligrams of ECGC, whereas one serving of leaner, which is three pills, contains 300 milligrams. So the research out there shows that 300 milligrams is the minimum required up to a max of about 1,000 milligrams a day in order to see the fat breakdown. Now, can you consume more? Yes, because there really isn't much side effects known for over-consuming green tea. Green tea has less caffeine than regular caffeine. So the only thing that might happen is you might consume a lot you might get like a kind of head high, like as if you're just pounding back espressos, but it wouldn't be as strong. And then you might have a crash. But ultimately, green tea is a great solution to help you decrease your appetite, to help you decrease your body fat, and to help you burn more calories at rest. So the next time you reach for a coffee, maybe you should consider drinking more green tea to help you with that body fat. So guys, in the comments below, I wanna know, are you currently drinking green tea? Are you supplementing with leaner? And do you prefer black or green tea? Put that in the comments, give the video a like, and I'll see you on the next one.